TikTok is the biggest social media platform that's trending today. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the power of TikTok and combine that with drop shipping so that you can bring tons of free organic traffic to your online store and make much more sales and profit. Not only that, but I'll also share with you some of the hottest trending products on TikTok right now, as well as how to find these products so that you can start your own sales trend on TikTok. So if you're looking for another way to market your online store, stay right where you are because TikTok drop shipping is coming right up quick intro and let's go Welcome back, I'm Liron, the content manager here at AutoDS, and as you know, in this video, you're gonna learn how to use the power of TikTok on your dropshipping stores to bring much more organic traffic and make those extra sales and profit. So at the end of the day, what we're looking at here is creating videos for our products and uploading them to TikTok and hoping that the video goes viral, and I'm gonna give you the best tips and tricks that you need to know in order to make that happen for your business too. So let's start off right from the top. If you are new here, this is the type of videos that we offer along with so much more content including product finding videos success stories case studies full tutorials live one-on-one -on -one webinars and so much more so subscribe to our youtube channel enable those bell notifications and let's get started all right so tiktok dropshipping what is it in the first place let's give this a brief introduction so tiktok is a social media platform that came out a few years ago and has gained large popularity and pretty much surpassed every other social media platform that i can think of so so today it is the number one trending social media app. So TikTok is all about recording short videos, uploading them and hoping that those videos go viral. Now TikTok has an interest algorithm. It's an interest based algorithm, meaning it doesn't really matter who follows you and who you follow. I mean, they will see your videos and you will see theirs. But when you upload a new video, then based on your location, TikTok is going to show these videos to people around your area. Now, if TikTok sees that this is interesting for those people who it's showing the videos to, then it's going to keep showing it to more and more people and slowly widen the view. So as your video starts to go viral, more and more people are going to see it, not just in your country and in your location, but also all around the world. So in order for that to happen, we have to record videos that are interesting for people. That's what it's all about. We have to catch the audience's interest. Now with trending products, we can actually do that, especially with the products that we're selling in our dropshipping stores. And that way, when one video goes viral, it's enough for hundreds, thousands, and even tens of thousands of people to see your video, click on the link inside your bio, go to your online store and purchase the product that they really liked when they watched the video of it. So that's basically how TikTok works with dropshipping. Now let's dive a little bit deeper inside and see what products are trending, how we can actually get this done and how we can even find these products so that we can create our own trending success story. Now, one of the things that I love about this method is when we combine TikTok with dropshipping, it really can be a winning formula because TikTok doesn't cost any money, right? You can just create your account, start shooting videos, upload them, zero dollar budget. And pretty much the same thing goes with dropshipping. So we create a dropshipping store on whatever selling channel so we can create our store on eBay, on Shopify, on Wix, WooCommerce, Amazon, wherever. And wherever we start, we can usually create a free account. And as we start to scale, we're going to start spending some money. But until then, we're going to make some sales and profit. So when we combine TikTok with dropshipping, we're getting a very low risk and high reward business model that we can adopt, succeed in it, and scale successfully. So one of the advantages when we combine these two models together is that we can quickly test the market and see what products are actually interesting for people. It's easy to increase our brand awareness this way because, well, when a video goes viral, then your brand is gonna be known to lots and lots of people. Therefore, we are widening our audience reach and we can easily connect with our customers. They can even send us messages on TikTok and we can answer them there right away. So that's how the two go together. And soon I'm gonna show you my TikTok account and how to find products there. But before that, I'm going to go through four products that are trending right now on TikTok. And if you want the full list of the top 10 products to dropship on TikTok, just leave me a comment right below this video. Hashtag TikTok. Let me know if you're going to implement the strategies that I'm showing you in this video. And I will share my top 10 products to dropship on TikTok in 2023. It's that simple. Hashtag TikTok. Write your comment below 
and I'll send you the top 10 products that you should be on the lookout for. So here are four out of those 10 products. The first one is handheld butter churn. So just check out this product right here. You can see that this video got 168,000 engagements or likes when we took the screenshot over 600 comments and 1,372 shares. So this handheld butter churn is a very popular product and it worked out pretty well for this seller. The second product is a door draft stopper. So you can see right here, 123,000 engagements, 768 likes, 15,000 shares or video downloads for this popular product. So door draft stopper is also very, very popular amongst drop shippers and customers who are looking for these products. Number three is a budget binder. This one got almost 7,000 engagements, 26 comments and 80 shares. And number four is a mini eyeglasses cleaner. This one almost 5,000 engagements, 35 comments and 209 shares. And that's just four products. If you want the rest, just comment right below. Like I told you, hashtag TikTok. Let me know if you're going to implement these strategies and I'll send you all 10 popular products to dropship on TikTok. That will help you generate the best ideas for your store. Now let's take it one step further. How do we actually find these products? How can we see what's popular, what's trending and what we can check out today? So first of all, you're gonna wanna head over to TikTok and start your product research from there. And I'm gonna show you how in a minute. But before that, I wanna introduce you to the AutoDS Marketplace if you haven't seen it yet. So if you are an AutoDS member, you already have access to our Marketplace where here we throw in tons of trending products to add to your stores. So if you're looking for really good trending product ideas, head over to the marketplace, choose your favorite category and start your product research here. For example, here we have this power bank and if we click on it, we'll get more product information inside, including the product's description, the seller's policies, the specifications, buyer reviews, and so much more. Okay, so you can get some really good product ideas from here and import them to your stores in just one click. So the marketplace is the number one source to get trending products and it's already integrated inside your AutoDS subscription, so why not? And now if you wanna do it through TikTok, what you're gonna do here is on your TikTok account, you're gonna search for TikTok made me buy it and this is the number one hashtag that's used in dropshippers videos to get their videos to go viral and get people to their online stores and purchase from TikTok. So as you see, I made the search right here and I can see that we already have a 2023 search term going on. So let's go with TikTok made me buy it in 2023. Now this isn't the only hashtag that popular dropshippers use to get their videos to go viral and help bring more traffic to their online stores. And in order to find more ideas, just open up these videos and see what other hashtags they are using. But let's just stick with this one for this example. Okay, so I'm just gonna go with this one right here. This whatever this is, I don't, I, I don't even know what it is. I can just see that it's really popular and I'm pretty sure it's a drop shipping product. So we can see right here that this video has, how much was it? 12,000 engagements, 405 likes, eight comments, and it's popular. It's like, it's trending right now. So what you're gonna do next, after you found a good dropshipping hashtag like this one, is go to the seller's bio and make sure that he left the link there. And that's exactly the same thing that you're going to do on your account. So after you choose whatever product you wanna shoot a video ad on, you're going to order it to your house, shoot a video ad, we're gonna go over that in a minute. And then when you post the video, then you're gonna want people to understand where they need to go so that they can purchase it. So for that, you're gonna have to leave the link in your bio. So here I'm gonna click on the seller's name. So his name is Remote Jobs in 2023. Comfy Caps Migraine Relief. So he's trying his luck with this product and it seems to be working okay, even though I can see from his videos here that he's testing out more than one product, which is great. But in any case, we're here to find his website. So we can see right here a bit.ly link. So I'm gonna click on that and that should take me to his website. Okay, and here we are. So we're at Comfy Gel Caps Headache Relief website. And even though he is bringing a lot of traffic to his store, we can just see by his videos where some of them are actually going pretty viral and these are all organic videos he's not using pay-per-click ads to bring people to his website and that's another form of TikTok marketing that you can use now if I go way 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 back you can see that the seller first started trying things out so in the beginning he was only making like 26 video views and then this one jumped up to 250 and then we're back down to 33 14 16 and in time as I scroll up you'll start to notice that he's having more and more success that's because he's researching through videos. And every time a video starts to go viral or has hints that it could go viral, then in the next video he thinks, okay, what did I do good in the last one? 
and what things didn't work out so well so that I can maybe not do it in my next videos. And that way you continue optimizing your videos until you make it to the point where every video has a few hundred views and then a few thousand views, and then it just becomes easier and easier. So if I scroll up to those most recent videos, we can actually see some success in some of them, even though I could not find the main video that I found during the search. But in any case, that doesn't really matter. We have his website and here is where he is targeting his audience. So if we take it back one second and look at his popular video, which is this one right here, that got 405 likes. This one brought a lot of traffic to his store. So this is his store right here. And we can see that he didn't even purchase his own domain name. He's making sales, he's making profit, and he's not going to even be that professional when it comes to creating his website. And as I scroll down, we've got this GIF right here, or GIF, whatever you want to call it. It's not in the highest quality because he kind of stretched it out. And if I continue scrolling down, we got the same. Is it the same? It's almost the same GIF, right? So in any case, um, it's not a very good product page. This text is way too big. Everything here is very amateurish and he's still making sales and profit because his video went viral. So if you were to do the same with a better product or even with the same product, but just have a better marketing angle and a better looking product page, then you're going to do a much better job than this seller right here. But let's take a look at the product. So he's selling this comfy gel cap for $29.95, free track shipping on on all orders. Now, in order to see where he's getting the product from, here's a trick that you need to do. First, open up the image. So now we got it in full size, even though it's kind of big. Then I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to search the image with Google. This way, Google is going to run an image search on this image and see other places that have the same image. And this way I can find his supplier. And in this case, we can see that Walmart has this product lots of times because there are also people on Walmart who are drop shipping this product. And if I go to this one right here, just at $15.99, this is a good example of where he could be purchasing this product from because as you can see, it's the same exact product. Only here on Walmart, it costs $15.99 with shipping included with tracking information. So that's exactly what he's doing with this product right here. And he's selling it for two times the price. So he's buying it for $15 and he's selling it for 30 for two times the price price and he's making the profit between the 15 to 30 dollars so he's making 15 dollars in profit not including the selling channel fees which is about 13 percent and the source tax which is another 10 percent in most cases but still He's making over $10 in profit every time he's selling this product. And you can be sure that he's making some nice sales, especially after this video right here went viral. Lots of people are clicking on his bio, on his link, going to his website and purchasing whatever looks good to them. So this is a great way to bring traffic to your website. And I'm not sure if he made a video on this product, but this is what TikTok dropshippers are doing. Okay, so now that we got a general idea of what products are trending and how to find other products on TikTok that are trending from other dropshippers and learn from their practices, let's dive in a little bit deeper and lower the resolution and understand exactly how you can implement it on your dropshipping store. So once again, no matter where you are selling, you can take one of those products and order them to your home and simply shoot video ads on it. Now, of course, this can come with a cost because you need to order the product. And usually when we're dropshipping, we're not ordering the products. It's as simple as as soon as we make a sale, we just go to our supplier's websites, purchase the product and ship it directly to our end customer. But in this case, we're going to have to order the product. Now, if you don't have video shooting skills, if you don't want to do it yourself, there are other services that can help you in doing that where you can send the product to them and they will do the video shooting for you. And if you want any recommendations on these service providers, let me know in the comments below and I will send them over to you. But in any case, in order to get started, here's what you need to do step by step. First, sign up for your TikTok account if you don't already have one. So you can do it through your PC by using your phone or email, or you can do it directly from your mobile phone. Now, creating your account is absolutely free, so no worries, just create it and you'll have a blank profile. The first thing that I recommend to do is to upload a profile image so that you will actually look like a brand, a business, just as you can see right here with our profile. So we have a profile picture, which is the AutoDS logo, and then we have all of the videos, as you can see right here, that we're uploading to our TikTok account. So your account is going to look similar to this one, only instead of seeing my face in most of your videos, you're gonna see your products, the products that you're trying to market and sell. 
sale. And believe me, guys, even if you don't want to spend money on your products in order to market them, this is the only cost that it comes with. You don't have to run pay per click ads. You don't have to pay any external traffic sources to bring traffic to your website. You do have to order the product to your home, shoot video ads. So this will take up some time and it's going to cost whatever the product costs. But if this video goes viral, your account is going to go crazy and so are your sales. And whatever the product costs won't even be a factor when you think about the next product that you're going to market. So keep that in your mind. It's all about testing. It's okay to spend money if we're accumulating knowledge, if we're learning from it. And hopefully in one of those tries, you're going to go viral and you're going to make some crazy sales. So after you create an account on TikTok, of course, you also want to have your dropshipping store. So wherever you're trying to sell eBay, Shopify, Wix, WooCommerce, Facebook Marketplace, Facebook Shops, create your store, add your products to them. So the products that you want to sell, the products that you research that are doing really well on TikTok, make sure that you have them imported to your selling channel. And one great way to import those products is by using AutoDS, the quick importer that we have here. So for example, if we want this headache relief hat that we saw earlier, I'm just going to hover over the URL copy it. And then we're going to head back to AutoDS. I'm going to click on add products, add a single product. Then I'm going to paste that product right here. And you can see that it automatically chose Walmart as my supplier. The region is the United States. Then I'm going to click on edit now quick where I can optimize the product before having it go live on my store. So this way you can completely optimize your product pages, make them look much better than your competitors and eventually make more sales and profit than they're making. So not only can you use this quick importing feature to import products really quickly to your stores in just a click, but you're also going to enjoy things like like price and stock monitoring. So if the prices or the stock ever changes on your suppliers websites, the same changes will automatically be implemented inside your dropshipping stores, along with automatic orders and so much more. That's where dropshipping automation comes in. And this is where you can really start to scale and make some great profit. But besides dropshipping automation, now that you have your TikTok account, you created your account on your selling channel, you added dropshipping automation so that you can easily scale your business. Now it's time to actually order the products and shoot a good video ad. And here's a good video ad that I shot for my product in a video where I tried dropshipping on Shopify with just a $350 budget. So I showed you everything that I did there step by step, including how I shot my video ad, how I ran ads and so much more that I did in that case study. So if you want to watch it, leave me a comment below and I'll send you the link to the I tried dropshipping project with a $350 budget. So there is an example of how to run a good video ad for your product and you'll have all of the best best tips, tricks, and examples there. Now, the important things to remember here are when you create a video ad for your product, you order the product to your house and you shot a few different ad variations. You need to show the product in action. You also need to show what problem this product is helping the customer solve. So this way, the potential customer can really understand what's so special about this product and why they need it. Now, there are different marketing angles and you'll never know what the right one is until you actually know dive deep inside and learn the mechanics. So you need to start, you need to test, you need to try different creatives, you need to change the first three seconds of your video and make sure that it's different every time with different texts, different effects, different background music until one video will catch on, especially if this is a product that people are looking for, even if they don't know that they need it yet. So this is a good thing to practice along with how are you going to actually make your video ad. So there's a good service called InVideo and this is a good place where you can simply log into your account, upload the video that you shot with your camera and do all of the editing through in video. And as you can see right here, I have the video ads for LED Looper, which is the video that I shot ads for in the I tried dropshipping project. And if I just click on one of them here, you can see an example of one of the video ads that I created for my product. So this is one of the video ads that I shot for this product. It's this round LED light and I'm simply showing it in action where you can use the app to play around with the lights and kind of customize it to whatever type of light you want to be shown, what color, what effect and so forth. And I also added background music as well as text that simply talks about the product, its features and what it can do. Now, I wasn't sure if this copy is going to be the winner. So that is why I created different variations, different styles, different texts, different music, different video lengths. And at the end of the day, I simply put all of them on TikTok and TikTok ads and try to pretty much see what's going to work and what's going to go viral. And you need to do the same when it comes to your product. Don't only test one product. So InVideo is a good place where you can completely customize your videos and make them look good for social media, for ads, for organic videos and so forth. I'm going to leave a link right below this video where you can sign up for InVideo and start trying it out 
out and see if it's right for you. Now, once your video is ready, you simply need to upload it on TikTok. So here I am on the PC version. I'm just going to click on upload. And now it's asking me what video do I want to upload? So I'm going to click on select file. Then I'm going to navigate to the folder where I actually have the video file. So I'm just going to choose one of the videos from here. This is one of the videos that I created using in video. So I'm just going to choose this one. Okay. And it's uploading in the background for now. Let's continue. Now we need a caption. So we need a good video title for this product. You want to make something engaging, something that will actually get people to want to understand what this is all about. So I'm not going to call it LED looper 30 sec testimonials. We're going to give it a good name. Like I never knew I needed this product. Okay. And then we can also add a hashtag for TikTok made me buy it. And you'll also see all of the hashtag recommendations that TikTok will give to you along with how many views these hashtags are getting. Okay. So I'm just going to go with TikTok made me buy it. And of course you can continue adding more Then who can watch this video. But before that we can choose a thumbnail. So you can just choose whatever thumbnail looks good. Then who can watch this video. So of course we're going to keep it public. We want as many people as possible to see this video, then allow users to comment, do it and stitch. We should have that all open because if anyone wants to comment, do it or stitch this video, it's going to bring us more engagement and more video views. Next, schedule video. So if you want to schedule to upload it at a certain time, you can. In any case, once you upload a video, it could take about an hour to three hours for the video to actually start showing up on people's feeds. And then if they like the video, if they watch it through at least a couple of times, it's going to continue showing to more and more people. And the more people it interests, the more viral your video is going to go. And run a copyright check. So it's always a good idea to do this. This way it kind of checks the video in the background. It listens to the music. It looks at the visuals and see if there's anything that's copyrighted copyright it here. And if it is, it will give you that warning. So you won't spend time uploading a video that won't really be relevant. And that's pretty much it. Once you're ready, go ahead and click on post. As you see here, no issues detected on the copyright check, then click on post. And that's all there is to it. The video is going to go live on your TikTok account. And that is how it is done. So once again, to recap, you need a drop shipping selling channel. You need a TikTok account and you need to order the products to your home or send it to a service provider that will shoot the videos for you. If you're sending it to your own house, you can use services like in video to completely customize the videos that you're shooting and create nice engaging copies that you can later test on TikTok. Once again, the best tip here is to make sure that at least the beginning of your video, the first three seconds are different from each video as well as try different texts different background music, different effects and different marketing angles, different shooting angles and a different way of speaking to the viewer who's actually watching this video. Then you simply need to go to your TikTok account, upload the video, make sure that you're using the right hashtags that will bring organic traffic to your store, especially people who are looking to purchase products from TikTok or kind of find out what new products are trending right now and go to purchase them. And last but not least, make sure that your TikTok profile has the link in your bio. Now, if you don't have enough followers yet, TikTok will still allow you to leave a link, but it won't be clickable. And after you have a certain amount of followers, that link will also be clickable. And that way you're going to get even more organic traffic to your store. And once your videos go viral, your TikTok account pretty much goes crazy. You're going to get an insane amount of followers for every Every minute that the video is viral. And here's just a small example from AutoDS's TikTok account. And as you can see here, the followers are coming in all the time, every minute, every hour of every day. And it's been like this for a while because a few videos go viral. And that is all that you need to get tons of organic traffic to your profile, to the link that you have there, get them to click on it, get them to purchase. And that is what TikTok dropshipping is all about. I hope that you found this video informational. Once again, if you want my top 10 products to dropship on TikTok, leave me a comment below, hashtag TikTok, and let me know if you're going to implement the strategies that I showed you in this video. And I will follow up and I will comment with the link of my top 10 favorite TikTok dropshipping products for 2023. Don't forget to like and share this video if you appreciate the value. Let me know if there's anything that I missed out that you want to know in the comments below. And once again, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to always learn about the next step in your e-commerce journey. Thank you for watching and good luck with TikTok dropshipping.